hi guys welcome back to the channel today's video is a diy deep conditioner that i use just two natural ingredients to make this so if you're interested keep on watching make sure you're subscribed to the channel and do not hesitate to give me a thumbs up because it helps youtube to recommend to more people searching for uh, such videos this hair mask right here will help you to revive your damaged hair give you strength to your hair so it doesn't break prevents hair loss and prevents dandruff on your scalp are you interested to hear more about this deep conditioner that will not only help to grow your hair but revive your damaged hair whether relaxed or natural then keep on watching hey guys are you suffering from dry matted damaged hair a lot of you ask how you can make your natural hair to be soft deep conditioner is your friend at this point if you are suffering from damaged dry matted natural hair deep conditioning your hair weekly is going to give your hair a very good texture making your hair easy to manage and also prevents it from drying quickly okay and if you are allergic to aloe vera, I will recommend you replace this mask in place of that because you are not going to suffer from any itchiness in, in case you are allergic to aloe vera. So let's get started. The very first ingredient you need for today's video is your fenugreek. Fenugreek is also known as methyl seed. This is popular in India and it has been used for ancient years to grow their natural hair dark beautiful and lovely i'm going to be using three tablespoons of my fenugreek seed okay i'm going to go ahead and also add a tablespoon of rosemary which i'm going to give you the benefits later let's start off with the benefits of using fenugreek on your hair fenugreek is rich in vitamins like vitamin a vitamin b c k and also some protein iron calcium potassium folic acid flavonoids saponins which are all compounds that will help you for your hair to grow beautifully and healthy i added some water to this right here and i'm going to transfer it to my stove right now for it to boil for five to ten minutes so my fenugreek seed will become tender okay now let me continue with the benefits of fenugreek fenugreek will help to prevent hair loss because it will help to moisturize your hair since it is slippery and it will deep condition and and uh, detangle your hair really nicely so if you are suffering from dryness fenugreek paste is one thing that you have to use okay while it is boiling make sure to stir so it doesn't get dry fenugreek will help to revive your damaged hair okay it will fight against dandruff because it contains antifungal and antibacterial properties it controls scalp inflammation because it contains anti-inflammatory properties and also contains natural antioxidants that will help with oxidative stress Fenugreek deep conditioner will help you to add shine to your natural hair, prevent premature grain of your hair because it contains uh, potassium in it as one of the compounds or the nutrients that are beneficial for your hair growth. Okay, you guys. So after boiling for 10, 5 to 10 minutes, let it cool down and after cooling down, Go ahead and blend this mix right here okay once it cools blend it and while I'm blending I'm going to bring in the third ingredient which is my moringa powder moringa leaves is rich in vitamin E which helps to promote hair growth okay moringa also contains vitamin C which is uh, beneficial to the scalp because it promotes the production of collagen and enables it to remain 
help your hair to remain elastic and movable okay moringa helps to strengthen the scalp and also strengthen your hair okay encourages blood flow circulation to the scalp and strengthens your hair okay you guys moringa will also help you to relieve your hair if, if you are suffering from um vitamin e deficiency then it's a great source of vitamin e you guys on the other hand rosemary helps with hair growth because it stimulates and improves blood flow circulation to the scalp thus encouraging your hair to grow beautifully rosemary also helps as a hair cleanser due to its antibacterial quality that it has that gently cleans your scalp on your hair it adds shine to your hair and it also helps with scalp issues like relieving your hair from irritation dryness flaky or dandruff infected scalp okay so that will help you with all those scalp conditions and what beautiful combination did i just make like this you guys hearing the benefits of these two products they work hand in gloves because you are treating your scalp at the same time you are moisturizing and giving strength to the strands of your hair so they don't break easily okay you guys and i went ahead and added extra virgin olive oil Oil to the mix just to give it that moisturizing uh, benefit that it also has that helps to condition the scalp works with dandruff and just give your hair that healthy shine look at how detangled my hair is in this section after applying this is what you are looking for in a deep conditioner if your deep conditioner that you use weekly is not giving you this result then you are not doing it correctly okay at the end of the day you are getting what you want your hair to eat and benefit from it all these benefits of vitamins and nutrients that it has will make your hair to grow beautifully okay now for those of you that are protein sensitive it doesn't mean you don't need protein at all in your hair it means you don't need to do it more often okay so it doesn't mean because your hair needs a certain amount of protein to survive it doesn't mean you don't need protein at all because i always get that question if you are protein sensitive if you can use certain deep conditioners and I think that will determine how often you use, not that you avoid it completely to the best of my knowledge. But if you know you are protein sensitive, then I, I think you should do more research on that. But I think this will be great for majority of you guys watching right now. Okay, especially if you are 4c strong matted hair and you have any heat damage and damaged hair for not taking care of your hair properly then deep conditioner should be your best friend from now on okay if you want to see good results working with your natural hair not to be strong and tangled easily deep condition your hair as often as you can if you ask me from the beginning i'll say do it weekly if you don't have time you can do it twice in a month which will still be a good and reasonable result for you so check out these sections my hair is healthy and thick look how bouncy my twists are just because i do this often okay now make sure once your hair is out of protective styling for a while or a long time you should not skip your deep conditioners okay but if you are someone that protects the hair all the time with protective style it's difficult for you to deep condition weekly but when you remove your protective style make sure to deep condition your hair look at how thick and bouncy my hair is it is as a result of using everything that i show you guys in the channel right now okay your hair is going to grow beautifully longer 
and healthier you should concentrate more on the health of your hair because once the health is on b guys they learn to come in okay learn comes with time patience and tolerance with your hair being careful with your hair understanding your hair and know what works for your hair you guys oil will not moisturize your hair oil will not deep condition your hair you have to give it a blend of deep conditioning your hair or moisturizing your hair to avoid dryness and all the work hand in gloves there is no one particular product that will moisturize condition and seal in your hair and give it that softness that you want okay it's a combination of everything put together I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial today. If you have any doubts, leave it in the comment section. I'm going to reply you. Okay, you guys, I just want you to see how bouncy my hair is after applying this deep conditioner. Okay, you guys, look at my twist. Look at the thickness of my hair and the length I've acquired for the for the length of time that i've gone uh natural again after my big chop and look at all the hair i lost uh i'll just grab the comb i was using to detangle my hair this was the toy that i had on my laps there's absolutely no hair on it anymore once i grab the one that is in the comb that i forgot to grab you'll see me grabbing that in a minute you realize my hair did not break much just a tiny bit of it but I'm sure if you don't properly deep condition your hair weekly or twice in a month or so the amount of breakage you get each time you do such things will be outrageous so the treatment you do will help you with hair loss help you with breakage deep conditioning your hair will help to strengthen your hair from roots to the ends of your hair so i'm going to put in my plastic cap right now and i will sit underneath this shower cap for 45 minutes to one hour when i did condition my hair i let it take time to sit in it okay so my hair can extract every nutrient that it needs from this and just heat it up as well so if you are low porosity hair you need time and if you have a dryer you can just enter under the dryer to open the cuticles of your hair